We are here, buddy. Welcome to another video with Brandon VR what YouTube. Hello. Welcome. So story time. Yeah, you're like story time. But Brandon, you don't do story time. Yes, I do. Tag. Before I start telling the story, I gotta check up some, some things. You know, you, you, know, you said I was checking it before the video. Let's go behind the video, you bit. Okay, it's time to start the story time. Uh. Hold up, I got it. I don't really feel like playing Call of Duty right now, so I'm just gonna play a clip and hopefully see what happens. So, right now, I'm possibly playing a clip if Editor Brandon, whatever, chooses to. I don't give two claps, but, uh, oh wait, I'm already editing. <laughs> Stupid me. Um, so, my editor didn't want to edit the video because it was too hard to edit a, a PlayStation video somehow. On a, uh, on a computer. That's gonna be impossible. I'm gonna need a lot of cords. So, okay, let's get into story time. Okay, so me and my friend, some other YouTubers, yeah, I collab with YouTubers, just not bull. Uh, I collab with other YouTubers, not small YouTubers. Some of them are big, like people that you might know. Uh, I did collab with them a couple times, and then, yeah. I have collabed a lot with a lot of people. Um, yeah, I can't say their names because they didn't give me permission. Let's call one of them Justin and Aaron. Me, Justin, and Aaron went to this uh fun little Good party. Game. Okay. And then there's this ego there. Like, I heard number and stuff. Uh, and then... I'm pretty sure I'm trying to remember uh but the e girl had pink hair like Belle Dolphin like she looked exactly like her it wasn't her but because you didn't have the voice but it looked exactly like her uh so she so she basically asked for my number I gave her it because I'm not that big um and then something suspicious started happening. I had clothes in my hotel room. Yeah, we rented a hotel. It was a diner. We, uh, this, a fan of mine, uh, said, "Hey, uh, you want some pizza?" So I'm like, "Sure, I can take me some pizza. Go big or go home." So I got some pizza. Went to this diner, chill on my phone, watching TikTok on a no, uh, with no account because. I'm bored, I w and then I, w I got off TikTok and I deleted the app, uh, and went to go watch some YouTube shorts, be down. and, uh, that's that, until the, uh, girl said, hey, can I come over? Like, I'm kinda in a situation right now where I'm in, uh, kinda with some, uh, a fan, a fan, yeah, I'm with a fan, and, uh, I'm trying, I'm looking through the text messages right now, yeah, I'm with a fan, and uh, I'm eating pizza, so you can go into the unlocked hotel room. I'll tell you that uh, we lost the hotel room key, so we only had one hotel room key. And one of my friends, Justin, and Aaron were at the party with the house key, so I told them to unlock the door so I can get in. And uh, stupid me told them that. I don't know why I was too so stupid. Uh, I'm trying to remember. It was like a long time ago, but uh, it was really recent though. Uh, but like, she, I'm assuming that she stole my stuff because I have expensive things in my bag, my suitcase, because I flew out to LA. Uh, and I got me some new clothes, which are expensive. You know how expensive things are in LA? I'm just kidding. Some of them are cheap. Uh, but some things are expensive. But, uh, 
after that, we were just chilling, like watching a movie. Said. Her friend came. I'm like, who's this? Oh yeah, that's my friend. I'm like, okay. So I opened up the door. I said, hey, this is the third wheel. Just got mad about. Uh, until something suspicious started happening. Uh, there is like some uh, pizza sauce on my shirt. It was a white shirt, which I was disappointed in because it was expensive. Uh, because and uh, because of that, I had to go change my shirt because I didn't want to embarrass myself. So to not embarrass myself, that's what I actually did. I went to go change my shirt. So after I went to go change my shirt, guess what? I found some clothes missing from the bag. And not my money. Okay, some money was missing, at least like a hundred thou. I'm just kidding. One K, one K, one K. One thousand. One thousand dollars was missing. And seven, nine hundred dollars worth of clothes missing too. I'm like, what the f is happening? Someone just tried to rob me. Zero so, I'm completely scared. Who robbed me? So I asked the ego, hey, the ego's friend, hey, can I check your bag? Because they had bags. I'm like, sure, open up the bag. And then the E girl, the main one, went to the bathroom. The one I look like Belle Dauphine. Uh, after that, I, I slowly opened up the bag and saw 1K and 700 more dollars of my money gone, which I didn't notice. Which I haven't noticed at all. I didn't know 700s went missing, bro. I did not know. I don't know how, but I just did not know. $700, bro. Imagine $700 went missing on your hands. Oh, I'll be so mad, bro. <laughs> Wait, it already happened to me, though. Crap. Uh, But she stole my money and then stole my clothes. And she wants me to kiss her she came back in the room and she tried to kiss me so I said you know your friend so I talked I, I whispered in her ear your friend is a steal the theft or thief however you want to say it uh but after that I went I went into the bathroom, I called my friend, Austin, he said, wow, you should actually, okay, you should, next step one, just confront her. So, I went to the hotel room, I confronted, confronted her, um, uh, she, she got mad, she said, she, she didn't argue, I said, look at this, and I dumped my, uh, clothes out of her bag. I'm like, and my money. She's like, that's my stuff. Mm, I didn't know you were the same size as me, huh? Yeah, now you all silent, huh? So her friend leaves. She says, yeah, he's right. Stop stealing. Or else we're not going to be friends anymore. Which, she said, fine. We're not going to be friends then. Because I didn't steal. So, my friends came. And we just saw her. She grabbed a kitchen knife. And tried to stab us. I mean, I mean, straight up, stab, like, in the back. And, like, I was terrified. She threw, like, nine kitchen knives at us, which she had in her bag for some reason, just in case she gets caught. And a BB gun, which her friend holded. So, never afraid of in, in my life. Which I knew it, it I knew. I did not know it was a BB gun. I didn't really use BB guns. Uh, but I knew it was really bad. I mean, it did hurt, because she shot me with it. 
shot. She shot me with it. She told her friend to shoot me with it, and I'm not loyal. And she shot me with it, because she's loyal. And then she shot her at least five times. And she's in pain. And I'm like, girl, you good? No, I just got shot with an airsoft gun. Dang, that's bad. I feel bad. Uh-huh. Yeah, you do. Even though I just stole your money. Yeah. Should not have stole my money. So, after that, he stole my money. She stole my money, right? And she left. Not a hissy fit. Threatened to kill me, which she tried to by trying to cut me. Yes, trying to cut me. Stab me. Yes, she tried to stab me, bro. Like, she was crying me, bro. Like, that is a whole nother level of insane. You don't just stab a, a, a non-popular person, bro. You're an e-girl. Do, do stream. She doesn't even stream. She does pictures. Takes pictures. But she tried to stab me. And she's like, fine, I don't need your designer and stuff anyway. It's not designer, it's Gucci. And I do need your money. Why'd you steal it then? And she just slammed the door and left. And then she had the airsoft gun open back up the door because she pickpocketed my friend. Yes, she is crazy. She pickpocketed my friend, had the key, or looking around for the key, and then, like, literally, 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 I'm not, I'm not joking. She had it open up the door and like, how you open up the door? I have the key. Give us back the key. No, and she shot me. Treat. No, she tried to shoot me with the gun. The cops were, were called, which was a good thing, but it was a bad thing for her, cause it, cause I was gonna rat her out. Humiliation. So. The cops came like 20 minutes later of her shooting me, trying to shoot me. She tried to shoot me once with a real gun, because she only had one bullet in the real gun, which I was thankful for. And then like at least 60 airsoft bullets in the uh, airsoft gun. Yeah, does airsoft have bullets? I don't know. I don't know about airsoft guns. I don't, I don't use airsoft guns. You're like, you never use airsoft guns? Yeah, but she shot me with it and it hurt. Yeah, it hurt. You say airsoft guns don't hurt. I have really, I have really brittle bones and bot and skin. Okay, so anything could hurt. You can literally pinch me, and I and would I be probably screaming. No, I would probably be stabbing you with a knife. See how's that feel, huh? I'm just kidding. My skin's not that brittle, like a pickle. Humiliation. So, no. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna do that. So she tried to stab my friend, but she successfully, successfully not did because she's not that crazy. But she did throw a knife at him and cut him in that. I literally injured him so much. He had to go to the doctor and get some stitches for that. He sued her. After he sued her. Okay, he didn't sue, but he got her arrested for assault. After that. She said that. I'm trying to remember. Let me check. Look at my notes. After that, she, um, uh, tried. Her, her friend tried, no, not her friend. She tried to kiss me. Again, I mean, like, she full on tugged on me and tried to kiss me. Said, I'll never leave you. You must be crazy. You look crazy. So, 
I'm gonna end the video here. Or the story. Don't trust the e-girl unless they're gonna steal from you. I'm just kidding. Wait, that was the wrong one. What was the moral of the story again? Uh. Oh yeah, more of the story. Don't. Moral of the story. Just. It's all about the personality and not how they look. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. It's all about the beauty. It's not. It's all about the beauty. But their personality. Unless they. Unless she a baddie. No, no, no. But the moral of the story is more of the story is Neutralize. don't be a douchebag don't steal stuff from people and make sure to subscribe and join the VR team goodbye